Hi again. So uh, another video just spontaneously showed up today. I actually saw the uh, teaser in the Baskin Robbins commercial with Orange Caramel and I was about to react to that because it was kind of a teaser and I like Orange Caramel and as I'm about to do that I see that uh, One the K or Lowen, whatever you want to call it, post this on their YouTube channel so I'm gonna check out the full song for a Bing a Bing by Orange Caramel <laughs> and I already know that the beat is going to be pretty cool and the visuals seemed pretty awesome too. Yeah, without further ado, let's get to it. Okay, so it looks like they're very warm and if I took anything from that commercial is that it's for ice cream. So I think this is probably like a CF music video. See already that beat right off the bat, it's killer. Orange Caramel is just one of those groups that I don't think they can do any wrong no matter what they do. Nana, ugh, her visuals kill me. And Reyna, like, Reyna's the epitome of cute. Well, Lizzie is too, they're all, they all, all of them are. <laughs> I like the comic book feel there is to it too. The colors are really popping and crisp and they they have the food hats again. It feels like they're combining all of the the concepts that they put in Catalina. It's cool and they're promoting their ice cream. This is this is kind of what I <laughs> came to K-pop for was these colorful music videos that just you can't take your eyes off. Has an infectious beat. <laughs> Sorry, just there was a little effect that looked like Lizzie farted there. <laughs> They're always so synchronized too. Even though it's such a simple dance move, they always manage to like synchronize it so perfectly. It has it reminds me a little bit of lipstick in the sense that there's like it's kinda like a ma a ma and then the beat drops, except it's a bing a bing. <laughs> I always wondered how the production makes those hats because I think it's real food and I mean those strawberries can't last for very long I assume. I like the songs like this where they layer the chorus with ad-libs. Even though the song probably isn't meant to be one of their stronger singles if it's like a commercial, but I can tell I'm gonna like this one a lot. I hope they promote this one. But it just has that like techno beat I wanna dance to a club in too. <laughs> and it makes you want ice cream. Just perfect combination. Pretty girls ice cream nice beats. Yeah, that was awesome. I think I went kind of all over the frame there. Hopefully that wasn't too bad. Um, I like that. I felt like I could really react to that. And maybe it's just because I was excited about it already, but I genuinely liked that. Um, Orange Caramel is one of those groups that I didn't really like at first because we don't really have that kind of stuff in North America, and um, but once I kind of got into them around the lipstick uh, concept that they were doing, I went back, looked at all of their stuff, and I liked a lot of it, and they're probably one of my favorite groups now. I also like After School, but I feel like Orange Caramel is starting to really 
stand out on their own now, which is awesome. And like I said, I hope they promote this one, but I have the feeling that since it's like a similar concept to what they were just doing, that probably won't happen. So what did you guys think about that? I feel like a lot of people are going to like this. And uh, let me know if you did in the comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. And also, just want to mention, you can also check me out on my main channel at youtube.com slash awkwardluke. I'm still kind of figuring out what I want to call my K-pop channel. If you have any suggestions for what I should call this Luke's K-pop channel, K-pop Luke, I don't know. I can't come up with anything better than awkward K-pop because it ties into my other persona. Alright, <laughs> I tried to leave there, but... That's everything for now. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing. Bye.